The Hot House project is part of the advanced design research in the final year of the Masters of Architecture program. This project is particularly looking at the process of research through design or design-based research. So what's happening with Cave Urban is that we've got a collaborative process going where the students are actually getting an amazing experience to work directly with people in the profession and they're really leading it as experts but then they're sitting together on a kind of a flat structure as a team. We want to create a structure that hasn't really been seen before, especially in Australia, and we want to push what we can do with a temporary pavilion. In particular, working with the team from UTAS and uh, getting the community involved in trying to create a structure made by the community for the community. The inspiration comes from the site to start with. Um, we are basically building a forest inside the forest, or so restoring the forest that should be here. We started off with site mapping about um, three, four weeks ago, so they've measured the site, looked at the fall of the site, gone through the design process, and now it's a matter of, okay, we've got a series of columns, will they work in amongst the trees? So they're, they're mapping out where they might be putting parts of the structure. They've got 20 days to build a structure that's 50 metres long, 10 metres wide, can hold um, 20 people for an intensive conversation, keep them warm and dry, and then open out to hold 200. That sounds like an intractable problem and an amazing challenge. There seems to be a bit of a reality show. <laughs> I mean, in our experience, that's what happens, you know, like, because we're all working and there's moments where we're under stress, like the, your actual, you know, the, your essence comes out and some people that you think won't work or you know, not interested, suddenly they get like fire and they're like the ones that go in the front and you know, all your kind of preconceptions are usually wrong. It's, um, it's really interesting and it's really nice to kind of get to know everyone by working with them. Uh, yeah, because it, it is, as Juan Pablo says, it's a very different side of people once they're out and it's going to be challenging because we're out here, it's a lovely day today, but you know, it's going to be wet at some points to get really cold and I think that's definitely an environment we haven't worked in before and so seeing how everyone reacts to that, you know, that's, that's going to be kind of quite make or break I think for the project. I think we've got a pretty awesome crew, like I've been chatting to just about everyone and I'm loving it it's, and I think everyone's feeling the same, like the um, guys from the art school are a really good crowd and we seem to all have really similar personalities which is nice. It's a really great experience for us and I think we, that's probably one of the main reasons we all signed up for this was the actual physical work. Coming out here and getting to build it and source some materials and just find everything is really cool. It um, popped up in my newsfeed on Facebook actually, it was weird, like last night I was just flicking through my feed and then it's just like this big list of my friends that are going to the hot house and I was like, oh, like I didn't even tell them that I was doing it yet, like friends were down here, I was like, this is so cool. I'm a sculptor, I, I do art, I have my studio in Chile and I make um, big sculptures, nose sculptures, eye sculptures. Uh, so that's, that's my life, that, that's what I love to do. I'm making these two pot bellies for the center of the, this bamboo contraction. Uh, I'm trying to make this look like a machine, like uh, the way that the minds work. So the people that are thinking in this place or so have this kind of heat and look like a, a brain machine or something like that. Everything is equally important for the whole project. Yeah, so minor details and everything, it's really, uh, we need to be spot on on everything. This is something different from working on site. This is my first time handling uh, steel materials and grinding. Um, it's good to see that everything is coming together, yes. Yeah.